Hey everyone, I'm Kenneth Connolly, the Head of Strategy and Experience at Conway Wealth. Welcome back to our Economic Sprint Series, where I'll cover some of the highlights of our July and early August report. Markets are now pricing in a 100% chance of a September rate cut, with focus turning towards whether it will be 25 or 50 basis points. Also, equity markets finished mixed in July, but the biggest story of the month was the 10.5% surge in the Russell 2000 as money started to rotate out of the richly valued tech stocks and into small caps, which had been out of favor for several years. The beginning of August, however, was marked with heightened global volatility and a sharp sell-off as U.S. recession concerns were ignited by the underwhelming July employment data and the Bank of Japan raising its policy rate from effectively zero. And on the other hand, many economists feel that the fear of an impending recession is premature. The bottom line is that with election and geopolitical uncertainty on the rise and the talk of a coming U.S. recession just dominating headlines, volatility may persist throughout the back half of the year. The best defenses for investors remains diversification and ensuring investment portfolios are properly aligned to financial goals. So please use the link below to access our full analysis and reach out if you'd like to discuss any of this in more detail.